Hello, welcome to our channel. Now in this video, we will tell you how the cast of 1987, The Bold and the Beautiful, has changed. I will show you what they looked like back then in 1987 and now in 2022 how they've changed compared to when they were on the show. Alright, let's go. Ron Mars in the movie, he plays Rich Forrester. In 1987, he was 35 years old and now he's 17 years old. I meant that I see a person with a heart and a soul. You care and you have to try to help that aspect of life. Mm. I've seen my share of things. Mm. I was going to be a doctor, so I was working in hospitals and it taught me, don't take the way I'm physically looking for granted. Catherine Kelly Lang in the movie, she played Brick Logan. In 1987, she was 26 years old and now she is 61 years old. Never mind. What? Well, any chance of me meeting her husband? Wouldn't watch us, let us watch the gory parts, but she just let us watch some season, kind of normal, if there were any. But she just remembers, she said the producer was horribly mean to her all the time. Susan Flannery in the movie, she plays Stephanie Forrester. In 1987, he, she was 48 years old, and now she's 83 years old. The fact that we had an arrangement. I was going to ask my husband to look at your drawings. I don't think that's going to happen now. On a couple of times, I've seen Catherine because she comes to visit me every once in a while, but I haven't seen Ron since he and I left the show. On behalf of all of us, John McCook in the movie, he plays Eric Forrester. In 1987, he was 43 years old and now he's 78 years old. Caroline, I have raised you to be many things, but not naive. It's a hell of a lot more than just a job offer, if it comes from him. <laughs> no, I'm a little long in the tooth for that anymore. So anyway, I don't need to go do theater. I have this job and it's lasting forever, decades and decades. Jacqueline McKinnis good in the film where she plays Duffy Forrester. In 2008, she was 21 years old, and now she is 35 years old. Just waiting for Phoebe to get here. It just felt like I had the wind knocked out of me. I just, I couldn't breathe. You know, we got back uh, in, I think we started filming back in May or June. Uh, and we were already going, well, I heard that we were going to do this storyline before we went. Hunter Tyler in the movie, she plays Dr. Taylor Hayes. In 1990, she was 28 years old and now she's 60 years old. Yes, um, who is this? Well, it's me, it's Blake. You sound a little out of it. Well, I, I'm working, I'm trying to work. To get your, you know, your lines in exactly the way you want them, and that's all that there is to that story. With the bold and beautiful and the young and restless, those stories are going on and on and on. Don Diamond in the movie, he played Bill Spencer Jr. In 1993, he was 31 years old, and now he's 59 years old. This is dangerous, Liam. And it needs to stop. Right here. Right now. Kidney cancer. My brother was diagnosed with a malignant brain tumor. Oh so um, that was uh, very difficult. And really, they were my, my best friends in it. Scott Clifton in the movie, he played Liam Spencer. In 2003, he was 19 years old and now he's 37 years old. But he forgave me instead. I mean, he... He opened up to me in a way he's never done before. But, but that, that's the idea, is, you know, if, if I'm having a panic attack this time, then the next time I want to be more resolved, you know, or, or, or if Bill... Is 
had the time in the movie she played Katie Logan. In 2003, she was 28 years old, and now she is 46 years old. Concentrate on homework with all that's going on with mom. You know what I think? What? And you know, and and um, you know, so I I tuned in because I was like, well, I want to see what everybody does, and. Winsor Harmon in the movie he plays Thorn Forrester. In 1996, he was 33 years old, and now he's 58 years old. It's only my life's work, isn't it? Every goal I've ever had. God, the only thing I ever wanted as a kid was to work side by side with my father. You come away with like, you know what? We need to quit worrying about everybody else. We need to fix what's going on in this country and what's happening to our children. You know, in every aspect. Thanks for watching the whole video. If you like this video, please share it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to support us in producing the next videos.